Yeah, and you were working with um with a very interesting project, right? Um, several months ago, I think, I guess, uh, probably a year ago now, uh, on the peak counting, right? Technology. What What did you learn there uh, as you start you, you start writing that grant and? Uh, yeah, so that was a, a really neat project, especially as a nutritionist, right? Um, so that that year, the pork board put out their first ever call looking for technology projects that improved or increased our efficiency of pork production. And so um, we wrote a grant, we being K-State, in, um, in cooperation with JBS. Uh, Dr. Kyle Coble was really instrumental in that piece. And then also Amazon Web Services, which is a division of Amazon um, that really focuses on these types of large data analytic um, or machine learning type of projects. And um, with the collaboration of those three groups, um, us being the researchers and, and JBS obviously having large production system and AWS and their, their data scientists, um, we set off to develop a camera technology that would count pigs. And um, we really started from scratch. We know that this technology exists in many other industries. Um, for example, when you're in an airport or a shopping mall, there might be cameras that count you as you, as you enter doorways. So the technology exists, but hasn't necessarily been applied to pork production or it hadn't at the time that we submitted that grant. And um, so we took AWS on site into JBS farms and really showed them where the challenges with counting pigs were. Um, and so that project was um, a year and a half long and where we ended it, we have a prototype um, with a given level of accuracy and the remainder of the project will be testing that prototype with other technologies that essentially um, were introduced to the industry during that time that we wrote, submitted, um, and completed our portion of the grant. So with these other solutions now available, we wanna test our prototype against those. And um, really some big learnings that came from that project were not even necessarily related to the specific algorithm or the specific pieces of hardware that we needed to deploy. Um, a lot of it, a lot of, at least for me, the learning came from the types of communication or maybe um, roles we want to have in these type of projects. For example, um, my job as, as kind of the, the coordinator was really to keep the AWS folks in touch with our team and the JBS team. And that it sounds fairly simple, but the reality is the industries that we work in were so, so separate that we needed somebody almost devoted to essentially, for lack of a better word, translating the needs of the two parties. So when Amazon Web Services would say, what if we change this about the way that we move pigs? I would say, well, that's not practical because X, Y, and Z from the pig production standpoint. And when um, from the other side, you know, from JBS's side, well, why can't we use this camera or why can't we use, why can't we just use a cell phone and create an app and simplifying the process well we need to develop algorithms um, and evaluate the accuracy so there was a lot of back and forth um, and it was um, really critical to have somebody who halfway understood both sides of the puzzle uh, um, i'm no technology expert but i spent a lot of time trying to understand what they do um, in order to make it applicable to counting pigs 